Have you ever thought about air and what's in it? I mean, of course, there's oxygen. Otherwise, it's kind of lights out for us. But other stuff floating around in our air are things like Wi-Fi, radio, and television waves. Maybe a little more pollution than is acceptable to our lungs. We'd like to think that sometimes love is in the air, but now we know that dating apps have taken over the love part of the atmosphere. Another thing that's in the air is water. And innovation can now squeeze it into a glass for us to drink. Here's Adam Yamaguchi to explain. It's reported 2.5 billion people lack access or infrastructure to obtain fresh water. And yet, it's all around them. They just need help from the sun to capture it. I took a trip to Tempe, Arizona to meet Cody Friesen, an engineering professor and founder of a company called Source, to learn how he can literally pull water out of thin air with his innovative solar hydro panels. What is Source? Source is basically a solar panel that instead of making electricity, makes water from sunlight and air only. Okay, I have no idea how you do that. Walk me through how that process takes place. Yeah, so in the atmosphere, the troposphere, the lower part of the atmosphere where we live, there's one times 10 to the 16 kilograms of water vapor. So that's one and then 16 zeros kilograms of water vapor in the atmosphere. That's more than six times all the Earth's rivers combined. And guess what? That gets replaced about once a week by the action of the sun over the ocean. So it's this constant hydrologic cycle. It's this massive resource that is sort of untapped, if you will. Solar energy powers the hydro panel completely off the grid, so it can be set up anywhere. Fans draw an ambient air and push it through a hydroscopic or water absorbing material inside the panel. We use sunlight to respire the water vapor back out to produce liquid water and effectively distill the water vapor from the air. Air pollution levels have no impact on quality because once the water vapor is separated from the air, it's already purified. Minerals are then added to enhance the taste. So standing here in this uh, unrelenting heat, is there like a tap that I can turn on? Yeah, so water? all three of these are plumbed into this building so people that are filling up their water bottles in the first floor can fill that up. But if you want to open that valve, there's going to be water kind of shooting out of there. Yeah, so that, that's the water that we're producing right now. So you think about what that means. If we can put up an array like this, you fundamentally shift that from water being a scarce resource to something that's ultra abundant. And we're now doing that in 45 countries. Everywhere. Everywhere. Yeah. I, I, this is just, it's mind blowing. 